The basement was totally dated and dark, like really low on lighting. The carpet was stained, the ceilings were stained, the fireplace was just plain brown brick, no mantle. The kitchenette was kind of non-functioning and the bar was non-functioning. You couldn't uh, pull a stool up to it. But it was warm and fuzzy because it had carpet on the side. I wanted it to feel clean and updated and bright, inspirational. I started by drywalling right over the paneling and then giving everything a fresh coat of paint. There are a lot of creative ideas that work in this space. The fireplace is one area that really turned out great. So I definitely wanted to add a mantle and I found this great faux stone at Lowe's that's um, really fun, a fun puzzle to put together. I wanted the TV to be able to be concealed when you're not using it, so I created um, sliding artwork on just a typical closet track. And um, the artwork itself is just on plywood using painter's tape and using shelf liner to, to create a mask to paint with. The table, I wanted something clean and something that you could see through so that it wasn't black, blocking the whole um, bank of cabinets. Um, the table itself is made out of just inexpensive slab Luan doors. So they're hollow core doors that are doubled up. Um, after we built the structure out of doors, we then just laminated it in, in faux wood. And um, we actually used only three doors to make that table and they're only about $25 each so it's a real bargain. I use the, the same great process to create this coffee table. It's so fun and easy. I just think it'll be really functional for the family. You can really let your personality shine through the artwork that you hang on your walls. The tree artwork is made out of dowels um, cut in, at different angles and different lengths, different sizes. And when you look at a branch, you know nature is imperfect really in many ways, so you can't go wrong with these. There's no certain way that you have to do it or, or put them together. My leaf artwork was obviously inspired by nature. And the leaves themselves are made out of plastic flashing. Everyone can use scissors and cut out leaf shapes, and then I had so much fun mixing different colors of spray paint to make the most natural, natural colors on them. This space is filled with tons of creative ideas at work. I think everywhere you turn you just get a warm natural feel and there's always something interesting to look at and it's also very functional. So just from a few you know, inexpensive Lowe's materials, we've just made a great livable space that this family will love for years.